bait like this. This is a big deal because a bass will get down and study a crawdad if you've ever seen them because they're very wary of it. Bass don't like to, bass are, are wary hitting a good sized crawdad because of the pinchers. So they study them real close before they bite them a lot of times. So not having that hook visible is a big deal. And then the, the really unique part about this, it's got a internal keel weight right here. This is what weights the bait down. So this is what makes it, you know, good pitching and flipping bait or just, you know, good falling bait. It just sort of falls down like that. So anyway, let's talk a little bit about how to fish it. One other thing real quick, I'll give you a little tip here on this thing that I, I found out is I, as I did it or I saw a study sometime, a study about two years ago, they were talking about the type of crawdads bass prefer. And they said in the study that crawdads that only had one uh, pincher on the thing, the bass preferred them a lot more than with two pinchers. So I have found that in clear water situation, I'll just cut one of the pinchers.